On tap for lips and ears, Miley Cyrus is singing the blues. Aniston and Mayer are making the moves. And Sex in the City makes Beltway news. Up top, Miley Cyrus has created a firestorm on the internet and beyond. Hey, Buck, what's the skinny? More Hannah Mon scandal as 15-year-old Miley Cyrus has gone topless for an upcoming issue of Vanity Fair. But the photos are very tasteful, and she's not pregnant, so let's focus on the positive. And P.S. It's all for Jesus. After saying she thought the pics were artistic, she is now embarrassed and sorry to her fans. Uh, she wasn't sorry last year for those girl-on-girl-on licorice pics because those were artistic. Disney is so mad, saying it's unfortunate Vanity Fair did this to sell magazines. Yes, it's too bad someone else got to exploit this girl besides you. Courtney? Miley also seems to be cleaning house. Dorothy, what have you heard? Courtney, an insider, told the National Enquirer that Disney executives put pressure on Miley to end her relationship with her 16-year-old boyfriend, Tom Sturges, after provocative photos of them kissing and cuddling hit the internet. Our source says that Miley, Tom, and Disney were none too pleased about the pictures being exposed. And when it came time for Miley to break the bad news to Tom, she became very emotional. Ouch, it's brutal having growing pains in Hollywood, isn't it? Hey, Noah, I hear there's a sizzling new duo on the horizon. That's right, Courtney. There's a new hot Hollywood couple in town. Jennifer Aniston and John Mayer spent a long romantic weekend together in Miami, just when we thought John hadn't dated enough celebrities. When approached by In Touch Weekly, John told us, yes, my weekend was great. Now it looks like Courtney Cox and David Arquette have a new couple to double date with. Thank you, Noah. Well, the Sex in the City craze has sashayed right into Washington. Hey, Anna, what's the Beltway buzz? Court, Washington's not known for its fashionistas, but one former Capitol Hill intern made it onto the runway in the much-awaited Sex in the City movie. Shannon Rustbelt, who interned for Republican Senator Jim Bunning of Kentucky, and then Ohio Republican Representative Mike Oxley, was cast as a catwalk prancing model in the movie, which premieres May 30th. So far, she's staying mum about what label made the crop pants and jacket ensemble that she wore in the flick, except to say it was a very well-known female designer. So she can keep a secret, sounds like she learned something in Washington. Thanks so much, Anna. Hey, Lips and Ears fans, we'll feature you if you send us your celebrity snapshots and video to our U Report address, www.foxnews.com slash Report. As always, thanks Buck, Darcy, Noah, and Anna. And remember, from your lips to our ears, we've got you covered.